I love this. Like, absolutely. This is a total, total, total must have. What a wonderful Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm doing my second trimester must-have video. So I'm just gonna talk about pretty much everything that I felt like made a huge difference throughout this entire second trimester. I am getting close to my third trimester. I probably have about three weeks left to go. So I just wanted to talk about everything that I have felt like really made a difference throughout this whole second trimester. I know things will continue to change as I get into the third trimester, so I might do an updated one then to show you guys what other products that I've been loving for the third trimester. But I'm just gonna jump right into it and show you guys everything that I have loved for this trimester. Okay, so the first thing I wanna talk about, you can probably find in absolutely every single must-have video is some type of oil or belly lotion. I have two of them that I want to quickly talk about. The first one is the Palmer's Cocoa Butter Massage Lotion for stretch marks. I know a lot of pregnant women use this throughout their entire pregnancy and they really feel like it makes a huge difference. I do like this a lot. It smells super good and it is like a lotion consistency. It's not oily. It's not anything like that. It absorbs quickly and it is like refreshing and nice. I do love this one, but I feel like I grab this one a little bit more. And this is the Bio Oil Skincare Specialist Oil or Specialist Skincare Oil. But this is probably, like I said, I probably reach for it a little bit more than I reach for this one, but they are both good. The only difference with this is that it is obviously an oil. So sometimes if I'm not throwing on like a pajama t-shirt or something like that, I have to let it kind of fully absorb before I put on like a t-shirt probably like this because I don't want any oil to get on my clothes. But if I'm just hopping into bed or like I said, putting on a pajama t-shirt, this is perfect. I really do use it every single night. As you can see, I'm pretty much already out. Um, I love this. I have been using this for actually so many years. I used to use it on my face when I had acne scars because it did a really good job at fading any marks. Also, when I had abdominal surgery a few years ago, I also used this on my scar and it showed really, really great improvements. So I saw someone using this for their belly and I would say it helps a lot. Not only with just stretch marks, I feel like a lot of people think that you get products like these just for stretch marks but as your belly starts to grow your skin stretches and it gets itchy so having products like this keeps your skin moisturized and keeps the itch to a minimum so that is very good because I used to get really itchy kind of like all over my belly and it was driving me crazy <laughs> and finally when I started using these products pretty religiously like in the morning and in the night I noticed that I was not having any of those problems but just to keep your skin as moisturized and fresh as possible, I would recommend one of these two products. The second product I want to talk about is this belly band. This one is by Jill and Joey. I will link it below. Um, and I love this. Like, absolutely. This is a total, total, total must have. During this trimester, I started getting extremely, extremely bad back pains. Like, so bad that I would like almost cry and like not be able to fall asleep, not be able to lay down. I was having all these problems with my back until my doctor recommended that I get a belly band. Basically, you just wrap this part around the front of your belly, wrap it around and you Velcro it in the back and you put it like right under your belly so it's kind of like supporting your belly and it really takes the strain off your back and helps tremendously. One thing I would recommend about this product is I used to not want to wear it all day just because I was like, I don't need it. My back hurt, doesn't hurt right now. It's fine. It's not a big deal. And then later in the day, my back would start hurting. I would put it on and realize it's not doing anything. I truly, truly, truly recommend that you put this on every single day right in the morning right when you know you're about to start your day it goes on pretty seamlessly under your clothes and most of the time you can't even tell you're wearing it um so i would say put it on in the morning when you start your day even if your back doesn't hurt because if you wear this for a majority of the day you'll notice that your back never hurts i used to like i said 
my back wasn't hurting in the morning, I wasn't gonna put it on in the morning. And then I would realize that the strain throughout the whole day would give me the back aches. I would put this on and it was kind of already like too late. Like my back was already hurting from all the strain from all the hours before. So if you put this on in the morning and you're wearing it consistently every single day, I can almost guarantee that your back aches are gonna be a lot better and pretty much non-existent. You'll see a major difference. Like I said, I don't know how it's gonna continue to work throughout the third trimester. I know a lot of people continue to wear it throughout their whole pregnancies, but I will update you guys then and let you know if it's still something that really controls and helps my back aches. But throughout the whole second trimester, this has saved my life, but really saved my life. <laughs> The third thing I wanted to talk about is this Harper Apothecary Magnesium Spray. So I never really heard anything about magnesium spray until it got sent to me by this company and I decided to try it out. Basically, it says it relieves sore muscles, restless legs, headaches, and sleeplessness. All you have to do is spray it on the area like three to four times. I don't rub it in, it doesn't say that you have to, and it's a nice like little misty spray. So you can kind of just spray three to four little spritz on area that you need some relief, and I'd say it works pretty well. I haven't used it on too, too many areas, but I have been getting a pain at the top of my belly. It kind of feels like a bad bruise and super tender and my doctor said that it's pretty much from the muscles stretching as my belly is growing so it's a normal pain but it's super 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 painful so i finally decided to try this i would spray a few spritz on the top of my belly and i would notice a huge difference in the amount of pain that i was feeling um, sometimes I even put it on the bottoms of my feet when my feet get super sore and it really does like it says relieve sore muscles and kind of just relieve any areas that are bothering you so I really do like this stuff it was something I've never heard of before I've never seen it in another video and so I'm glad that I've been trying it and using it because it really has made a difference so the next thing I want to talk about you can see my dog pretty much laying in the middle of it this is a pregnancy pillow. So as you can see, it is a huge U-shaped pillow and you sleep with your head up there and then you can kind of pretty much spoon either side of it. So no matter which way you turn, you have a nice pillow to put in between your legs and that really gives a lot of support. It helps with any pains you're feeling, it helps with back aches, it just helps overall you sleep better, especially while pregnant. My husband got this for me as soon as he found out I was pregnant. Like I think I was literally like seven weeks pregnant and I have fallen in love with it. I feel bad because it's like a barrier between us, <laughs> but I love, love, love this pillow. It has made such a difference. I used to have to like tuck the sheets or take a pillow and put it in between my legs, but then whenever you turn sides, you kind of have to like tussle with the pillow and bring it with you. I love that you can completely just switch to another side and you already have a pillow set up on the other side for you. Some people use it without a pillow. I put one nice comfy pillow that I love right there at the base of it and I would just sleep on the pillow and then have this in between my legs. As you can see, like I said, it is humongous, really. Like this is my whole body. <laughs> so I absolutely love that body pillow. I would say 100% is a must have. It changes the way you sleep while pregnant. Your belly, as it gets bigger, it starts to get uncomfortable. You kind of like having a support on one of the sides. This truly makes all of the difference. I think you got this at Bye Bye Baby. I'm going to link everything I'm talking about below, but I will link this and I will show you guys exactly where to get it because it is absolutely amazing okay so the next thing i wanted to talk about is nursing bras you're probably like why i need a nursing bra right now before you have a baby and it's less of the fact that it's a nursing bra and more of the fact that it is has like these elastic bands at the bottom that are just very comfortable pretty similar to like bralettes and just like kind of like soft sports bras so those work just as well I just am showing you this one because I recently got it, but this is the only one I have. Most of the time I use sports bras or like super soft bralettes. The reason I would say that they're a must have is because like I said, at the top of my belly, I have been getting 
pains and as my belly's been getting bigger my actual bras have been starting to dig into the top of my belly and i have been going up in bra sizes but regardless most bras they just have a tendency to dig into the top of your belly and it does not feel good so nursing bras bralettes or super soft comfy sports bras that aren't too tight are perfect because they don't dig in and they make you just feel overall better and more comfortable so that is why i would say that these are a true must have the last thing I want to talk about is a nice big water bottle. This one I love. It's a Yeti and it has the straw cap and I think this one is the 32 ounces I believe. And the reason I'm saying this is because while you're pregnant you need to be drinking a lot of water. And if you're anything like me then you prefer cold water so i like these that are super insulated with the yetis the ice does not melt literally for like 24 hours like 24 hours plus i think literally and so that's why i would say to invest in a water bottle that meets your needs and even if you don't care and you like room temperature or you like warmer water or however you like your water i would say invest in a nice big water bottle that you can pretty much carry with you wherever you go you can carry around the house you can put next to your bed at night everything because you need to be drinking a lot of water and i think having something that is cute that you like and that is convenient and works for your water needs it's just you might as well have it because you're gonna need to be drinking out of it all the time i would say it's more convenient than filling up like a million different cups throughout the day and all this stuff i just use this i keep my ice and water in it and i am sipping on it constantly okay guys so that pretty much covers all of my second trimester must-haves i truly would say that everything i talked about especially the body pillow and i would also say especially the belly bands are really 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 essential for your second trimester your body is constantly changing you constantly have to adjust to everything that's happening and just kind of meeting those needs and getting stuff that's going to help you throughout your pregnancy is going to make it a little bit easier and not as painful and uncomfortable so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i think i would do an updated third trimester one probably in the summer when i'm closer to like the middle or the end of my third trimester talking to you guys about what products really have been helping me then what, what which one of these products i have brought with me and still like but pretty much i would say that covers everything so far that i use every single day so like i said i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you're new here don't forget to like and subscribe my hubby's normally with me and he posts with me about two to three times a week so stay tuned for videos subscribe like leave a comment on more things that you want to see and i will see you guys in the next video